Welcome to State Attack. Let's take a look at Cut Story available for your iPhone. Now when you first launch it, you can either choose to create a video from video files or photos. We're going to go and start off with a video file. We can choose from either our camera or our camera roll. I'll go ahead and choose a video for my camera roll and you can see all the videos are on my device. Tap on one, I can go ahead and tap save and it's going to move on to the next step. Or I can even add music in the top right hand corner. Now we can cut our videos to a duration to one of these social networks or we can even choose a custom one and keep in mind with the custom one we can only cut it to a specific length based upon the video file. So this happens to only be 13 seconds so that's going to be my custom length. But I'm going to go ahead and save it for Instagram. So we'll tap on Instagram, it's going to load in and then begin saving the video file in an Instagram friendly format so that way once it saves to my camera roll I can immediately post this to Instagram without having to worry about fitting any sort of time restraints or restrictions that Instagram might impose. So once that is done we'll be able to move on into the next step which will show you how to create a photo slideshow using photos and even adding music to that one to make that video a little bit more interesting. So now that it's completed, we're brought back out to the main menu where we can choose to create photos and we're going to choose our camera roll again, but we could also choose the camera. Choose as many photos as you would like. So I'm just going to go ahead and choose a wide variety of photos that are currently on my device and then tap done in the top right hand corner. You also notice that when you selected the photos, it put them in a specific order as well. So there were numbers on those photos. Now we can choose how quickly we want our photos to actually appear in the slideshow. You see I'm scrolling on the bottom, I'll go ahead and tap next when I've got a perfect time and then tap the music in the top right hand corner to add any music that's on my device. Now keep in mind the music needs to actually be purchased through iTunes. If you have an Apple Music subscription it won't work because it needs to live locally on your device. So actually make sure the music you're trying to add has been purchased via iTunes. So once you've got that music timed out go ahead and tap save. The same options as before we're going to go ahead and cut the video to duration to one of our actual social networks. Notice we can actually with the custom one come in a little bit longer. And once you're ready to just tap your social network and it's going to save that video file out. Then once that's done, if we come back out to the main menu in the top left hand corner, we can leave the developers feedback and support. So if you have anything that you want to let the developers know, let them know. There is also an option to disable the cut story logo in the save video for a 99 cent in app purchase. And we can see some more apps by the developer in the top right hand corner. So once again, this application is called cut story. If you like it, pick it up for your iPhone in the app store.